Let's start for now and see how it will go. Thank you, Jesus. Today, today, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I will be on on uh, uh, four o'clock, four thirty, four o'clock, uh, four 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 o'clock p.m. or four thirty p.m. Then, and I'm going to co start coming to for uh, midnight prayer. I will see how it will go. But let's continue. How to win and achieve excellent things. Let's look in the book of Proverbs 9, verse 9. The book of Proverbs 9, verse 9. The Bible says, Give instruction to a wiser, a wise man, and he will be yet wiser. Teach a justice man, and he will increase in learning. If you give instruction to a wise man, he will be yet wiser. If you give instruction to anybody who is wise, he will use that instruction and go. That's why I'm teaching you. I've been teaching you a lot of deliverance prayer. And I even tell you to confess them. Follow them. This prayer, it will deliver you. And if you cut them, you, you will, you will ne you are never, ne your life will never be the same again. That's why the Bible says, teach a wise man. If you teach a fool, it is like you are doing nothing. But if you teach a wise man, he will be a wiser. And he will listen and learn. That's why my sister Victoria, she's there always, always, always. When she, hear, she sees my periscope, she's there. This deliverance message, it is deliverance. It is going to deliver you. You know, many churches, they don't teach these teachings that I have given you. We have a program now, six weeks training you how to do spiritual warfare if you want to become a deliverance minister or if you want to, to help yourself and your family. You need to go to this training for six weeks. I will train you one-on-one -on -one so that you can understand. As the Bible says, you will become a champion if you know this instruction. If you need to get the instruction, you will become a champion. You will become a university champion. You will become a champion that the demon will not stay where you are. You will, you, if you can understand this instruction we give you, I'm giving to you. And the Bible says this instruction, it is everything for your life. It, it will change you. It is money. It is everything. It is wealth, wealth. As long as you catch them and you hold them, you use them. This instruction, it is, it is for wise people, not fools or stupid. The people call them, training a stupid is like carrying water in the basket. Training a fool is like carrying water in the basket. That's what the Bible says. Because a fool cannot understand what you are saying. Or training a fool is like a singing a, a song to the, to the court. If you sing a, a song to the animals, to the, the dog will dance, but the court will just make, become more crazy and run away. So in, this instruction belongs to children of God who obeys the word of God. As you know, the word of God is telling us clearly, clear, clear, crystal, crystal clear, that we, we, if you are, you are teach a, a, a wise person, you will become a wiser. Teach a just as man, a just man, he will, he will increase his, his learning. Our lectures, when it comes to our, our class, when I was in the training, when I was in the college, I was dealing, I was doing this deliverance ministry. The lectures just come and give you a word. And it says, you, are, you prophet, as prophet, go on, go on. Just one word. So after that one word, you increase, you continue running, you continue medicating, you continue, uh, continue uh, studying, and you make notes, you make your prayer points. When it comes, you are a sober, you can go and start preaching out of the message that you have got from your professor, from the teacher. So uh, we were given one word, which is saying that, do uh, I remember the word? Let me see if I can remember the word. In Calgary, our our instructor, Dr. Hazel Hills, he was she was teaching us uh, one of the subjects. I don't know which, what which is that, but it's a long time, so I have to forget a little bit. 
yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a subject called how do you preach? How do you, how do you preach? That's the, that is the topic. How do you preach? How will you, how do you preach? How do you prepare your, your sermons and prayers? So I, that is a topic. Some people, they came up with so many ideas and some um, um, lectures were watching us and everybody was watching us, the students, how we present ourselves. So when you get a, a word, this word, you will use it for your help and it will benefit you. Now, when the Bible says, give instruction to a wise man and he will be yet wiser, teach a just man and he will increase his running. So that, is, that, 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 that means that if you teach somebody who can help, who, who, who appreciate, it will even stay with the, with the person. But if you teach somebody who does not, who does not appreciate anything, criticize, gossip, it is a waste. This word is life, and it will, it will change your life, it will work on you. Let's look in another scripture. From the book of Proverbs, this is the book of Solomon. There was no king who was as, as, as David his record. No one in the world has defeated the record of, of King Solomon. King Solomon has so many proverbs. King Solomon, he was the, the, the wealthiest person in the, in the whole of Israel. King Solomon, nobody has break his record. He is keeping his record up to now. Everything Solomon did, his record, is, nobody has, re has break the record. Nobody, no human being has break the record of Solomon. If it is women, no man has ever have 700 women and 300 congregate <laughs> than Solomon. If it is wealthy, Solomon was wealthy. And God promised him. So that's why his Proverbs is so much. There are a lot. Now, let's look in the book of Proverbs 8, verse 1 to 36. That's why I said, if I don't finish today, I will continue. And we want to study this scripture from the book of Proverbs 8, verse 36. You can go home and study it. Study this scripture. I will help you to understand. This is where everything is, belongs to you. Anything you want is from this scripture. If you anything you want in your life, it is from this scripture. Proverbs 8, verse 1 to 36. The Bible says, Does not wisdom cry out and understanding lift up her voice you see wisdom that's why the it, it proverb says give instruction to a wise man and he will be yet a wiser and teach a justice man and he will increase his learning so the bible is asking does not wisdom cry out and understanding lift up her voice the the wisdom is crying out and understanding lift her voice. So wisdom is crying out so that people can go for wisdom. I have been saying all the time, when you are facing difficulty, when you are facing frustration, don't give the devil your tears. The situation you are in right now, what you can do is to ask wisdom. Ask wisdom. Say wisdom. God give me wisdom uh, for this problem. God give, give me wisdom how I will come out from this problem. Now you feel bitter, you, you start crying, you forget everything. Even if you know, even if you pray and fasting, prayer so much, prayers and crying, it will not work for you. When you start thinking how you can get out of that problem, when the problem is facing you, deep problem, very hard problem, it is when you look for, for, for wisdom. Listen, she takes her seat on the top of the high hill beside the way where the paths meet. She cry out by the gates at the enter of, of she cries out by the gates at the enter at the entry of the city. It, it, she, she, she. You know the Bible says she is a person. She sit, she takes her stand on the top of the high hill beside the way where the paths meet. She cry out by the gates 
at the entry of the city. All the entry of the doors. Wisdom is a person. Is crying in, on the entry of the city, in the entry of the doors. The wisdom who is crying in the entries of the city, in the entries of the doors, everywhere is there. It's like a sun or a moon. When we were coming from Nagra Falls yesterday, we were looking in the, the sky and we saw the, the image, the form, the star, the, the, the crowd, how it looks like. And the moon was following us. I was saying, look at the moon. It's still with us. It's going, going, going. So wisdom is everywhere. It's crying out. It's looking somebody who can ask him, what, what, I, what do you want? Wisdom is crying to know, to ask you, what do you want? What do you want me to do for you? To you, O oh men, I call and my voice is to the sons of men. Wisdom is calling, and this voice is in the sons. You know we are sons of God. Sons does not mean that you are a woman. We are all the people of God. So now he's saying, I am, I am, I am, I am making noise. I am crying. I am calling you to take me, to have me, so that I can help you. I am everything. Oh, ye simple ones, understand prudence. And you fools be of an understand heart. Listen, for I will speak of excellent things. You see, wisdom has excellent things. When you listen to wisdom, it has excellent things. Wisdom is a person. So his things, he has excellent things. And from the opening of my lips will come right things. The opening of the of the mouth, the mouth of wisdom. When it open, you know who is wisdom. You have now co coming to understand who is wisdom. When he opened his mouth, when she opened his mouth, because we, we are this she, when she opened his mouth, it, things, excellent things comes out. Good things comes out. So, Miss, Mrs. Wisdom, that is a wisdom, is a person. Her thing, things which comes from her mouth, it is powerful and it is right and excellent. For my mouth will speak truth. Weakness is, is an abomination to my lips. All words of my mouth are righteousness. So, you have to believe wisdom. Wisdom, when it speaks, wisdom, when it speaks, it, it tells the truth. He has the truth. He doesn't lie. He has excellent things. We call it she or she. Whatever name we can say here. But we know he's a person. So when she speaks, she speaks truth. When she, she presents herself, she presents with the truth. The truth is that he doesn't lie. He doesn't have any wickedness. That's why I'm telling you that if you are facing a situation, call wisdom. He is there to guide you and direct you and to give you ideas how to come out from that problem. Nothing crooked or preserved is in them. There is no crooked thing to wisdom. Instead of gossiping, instead of crying, instead of beating yourself, instead of bribing, Instead of bribing, taking money to go to the satanic bank to give them your money that you want help. Instead of going to false prophet, to sakek, you give your sakek your hand to, to tell you the future. And the wisdom is here, crying, calling, calling for you. It's saying that he doesn't have, uh, she doesn't have crooked. Her ways is perfect. Receive my instruction and not silver and knowledge. Said, look at verse, verse 9. It says, They are all praying to him who understands. All rights to those who find knowledge. They are all praying to him who understands all rights of those who find knowledge. If you understand and find knowledge from wisdom, it is praying. There is no crooked. 
The Bible says, receive my instruction. Receive my instruction and not silver and knowledge rather than just, uh, just, 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 just and gold. For wisdom is better than robbers, and all the things on may desire can be compared with her. Wisdom is more than money. If you are given one million right now and you have no wisdom, you can squander that money and then you become nothing. Uh, you have seen people with money. Today they are very well, tomorrow they are nothing. That is why you need wisdom. That's why you need wise wisdom. That's why you need wisdom to help you. If you are given $20 and, 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 and you have wisdom of $20, the twenty dollars will make you. It, it, it you will use. You will make a use of twenty dollars. If you give a, a fool or somebody who doesn't have wisdom twenty twenty thousand dollars tomorrow, he doesn't have money. You can go to the the, the person who has twenty dollars. A twenty thousand person can go and beg that twenty thousand twenty dollars from a person because he is squandered. He doesn't have wisdom. He doesn't know what to do about it. When he gets this money, he will go and buy and drink and do everything he wants to buy. Then the money ran out. But, but when Mr. Wisdom is in $20, he will think of how, what is the best, what am I going to use with this $20? He will, he will, she will keep it this $20 to think and give permission Wisdom what to do about with the $20. But when you don't have wisdom, immediately you get this money, you will finish, you squander it, you will finish it in a minute. That's why it says that wisdom is better than robia and, and, and gold. It is, it's, it's better than all the silvers and the gold in the world you have. I know somebody, he was very smart, very, very, very smart. He got, he, in the university, he got first class. He got a, 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 a straight away. But he doesn't have any wisdom. He's very smart. He got a, a straight away. Six A's. In the university, he's got first class. Almost everything. But he doesn't have wisdom. He, he was hired as a, as a teacher in the, in the university. He started teaching. No, in the second school. He started teaching. Now, the teacher... He has his wife. This AA man, he has his wife. Very beautiful young woman. This man decides to leave this woman and go to sleep with the, with, with the 12 years old girl who was, who was helping her, who was helping them. A maid, who is, who, she was a poor child. She went to help them because they are poor, so the mother gave them to go and work for them so that they can, the family can get money from her. And then this man, she, he did a great mistake to go and sleep with this girl. A, 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 a first class honors degree. Truth. Truth of, it's very true, the, the truth I'm telling you. Now, after this, the woman, the wife now, Decided to go home from work around 10, 11 o'clock. Something told her, go home and see the, 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 the girl there, what she's doing this time. Then the woman went. She didn't drive, she just went with the taxi. After she reached home, she saw the house locked. She had the key, she opened the house, she entered. Something told her, go straight to your bedroom and see what is happening. Something just told her. Then she went to the bedroom, she found the, 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 that man on top, of the room, on, the, on top of the girl. The girl was crying little bit, slowly, slowly, but the, this man was still, keep quiet, keep quiet. Then when this man, this woman caught them red-handed like this, the woman started screaming, come and see, come and see, is this what the, the, you, a teacher can do in these quarters? Now the woman was mad, she started screaming so hard. Because of that, the, the man ran from the woman, the, that girl, naked, and the girl was also started crying. Then tension. Everybody, it was daytime, 11, 11, 11 o'clock. School was there, students were there, everything was going on. Now the woman also tear her clothes, screamed to hide. People came around to see what's happening. 
they found that the, the, the man is running in the house because the, the woman is screaming, everybody's naked there. So the woman, the man was arrested at AA, and that was the end of, our, of, his, of his career. He was arrested. He was arrested and he would lose his job. Now the man, after his, his, his punishment, he came out and he started drinking. I went there last time when I, I was in Africa. I, I try I remember in my ask you, how is that person going on now? Does, did he receive Jesus Christ as a personal savior? I was told that the man is still drinking, he's becoming useless, you can't recognize him. That is the work of the devil when you don't want to seek for wisdom. When wisdom, you don't have wisdom, that's what will happen. Wisdom, if you don't have wisdom, if you have wisdom, that the one that the Bible is saying, chances is very narrow to lose like that. When you don't have wisdom, all witches and wizards would, would be your field. That's how it works very well. When you, you know, you open yourself to the devil and the devil will come in, it will open so many things to you. So the best thing, when something has happened, the devil is looking to see what action you are taking. You start crying, you start becoming bitter, you start becoming so arrogant, you, you feel angry with everybody. Like yesterday, Mother's Day, people were celebrating their mothers and, 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 and their children were taking out their mothers, they were celebrating those with mothers. But in Africa, we don't have something like that. It, it, the people, they don't do that. But in the towns, in the cities, all few of them can celebrate, but majority in the village, other places, they don't ce celebrate that. But other people, even here in, in West countries, sometimes you feel bad. You say, why? What is this during a celebration like this? When you feel like that, you know you are inviting. If you are a Christian, you are inviting the demons and the devil will come and start tormenting you. So, but when you have wisdom, you say, Mr. Wisdom, Mrs. Wisdom, sir, Madam, I am here. I know that this is my situation. I am. I need your direction. I need you to help me, to guide me now. Show me what to do out of this. Then wisdom will appear. Wisdom will appear and start talking to you. Look at this. I, wisdom, dwell out with prudence and find out knowledge and design discretion. The fear of the Lord is to hate evil. Pride and arrogance and the evil way and the preserved mouth I hate. So, because of arrogance, pride, you don't have to seek wisdom. You think you know everything. You don't know nothing. You, are, you don't know anything. You need wisdom. You need the wisdom of God. You need the wisdom that will help you. Because arrogance, pride, you see, it says, I hate them. I hate such, such a mouth. Wisdom hates such a mouth of wisdom. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. Wisdom. Wisdom himself. Wisdom herself hates that arrogance and pride. When you are so bright, you can't even ask any advice. Somebody came to me. I prayed for the person. The person was healed and they gave a testimony. Because of my background, because of I, uh, the way I struggled to talk or whatever, he didn't like me. He hit me straight away. He got a miracle, but he doesn't want to say that I prayed for, for him. He doesn't want to, to say, he doesn't want to glorify God, say that I prayed for him. He started twisting and twisting, twisting. I said, I know you. Don't worry. Don't worry. You, you, God has done for you healing. Go. I didn't heal you. It's Jesus. So whatever you do, you pride, pride. Because I'm a woman. And now this man, he, he, there are the people who does not recognize women like leaders, like pastors. They, they are the ones who disrespect the women. But when he came to me, God did a miracle. He prayed to prove that woman can, God can use a woman, can use anybody. But because of arrogance and, 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 and because of arrogance and, and pride, he was not able to mention, he was not able to say that God, God used a woman to heal me. 
He never, he never, he didn't want to say that. And I know, I told my, my, my people, I know this person who he is, is not with us. Don't worry about him, leave him. Yeah, and that is exactly what, what, he, what he was. So pride can deny so much stuff. If God has healed you, whether from a woman, from a man, give God glory. Give God glory. That's why you need wisdom. You have to ask God, give me wisdom. Look at this, verse 14. Counsel is mine, and sound wisdom I am understanding. I have strength. You see, counselor is mine. Wisdom, the counsel that we give people is, is from wisdom. Sometimes you don't know what to answer people. People call me and ask me questions. You don't know. But when you have wisdom, you ask wisdom. Wisdom, give me a word. What can I say? What can I tell this person? Then wisdom will give you a word to say. Wisdom is everything I'm telling you. You will be shocked how wisdom works. He understands everything. Wisdom understands everything. By me, kings reigns. And rulers degree justice by me. That is wisdom. By wisdom, the kings rule. Princes, if they have no wisdom, they can't rule. That's why the, the, the president, the kings need wisdom. If they don't have wisdom, they can't do anything. By me, princes rules, nobles, or churches of the earth. The churches of the earth, they need wisdom. They need this wisdom. That's why they can't do things, things by themselves. They, they lie on wisdom. They said, now what can I do? They give permission to something to talk to them. Sometimes a case is very, very difficult, very hard. But when they give wisdom permission to, to, tell, to tell them, they will come up with the good ideas. I like President Obama. Obama has full of wisdom. That's why he never lose. He went through out. Because of his, that wisdom which was in him. So when you have wisdom, no matter circumstances, no matter problem you are facing, it will take place. Wisdom will come and help you. It will come and tell you and, and, and get you out of that problem. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, we thank you. I love those who love me. You see? I love who, those who love me. Uh, here is where the devil preaching the message that God help those who help themselves. That's why this is where the devil quoted quote this scripture and they twisted it. There's no scripture where he says God help those who help themselves. You know you cannot help God. It is God to help you. You have to read God to help you. Now here, wisdom is saying that I love those who love me. If you love wisdom, you can have everything. Those, and those who seek me intelligently, intelligently will find me. If you, seek in, if you seek wisdom intelligently, you will find me. Riches and honor are with me. Look at wisdom. Wisdom is the honor of riches and, 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 and riches and honor. Wisdom is the one who has riches and honor. He has riches. If you are looking for riches, wisdom has riches. And the honor, wisdom have honor. If anybody disgrace you, wisdom will take over. Wisdom is the honor of riches and honor and, and, and everything that, that you may look for, you, you, you may want. Those who seek me intelligently will find me. Verse 18, he said, Riches and honor are with me, and endure riches and riches. You see, wisdom is the honor of riches and honor is the wisdom is the is wisdom horns. Riches and honor are with him or with her. So when you look at if you are looking for wealthy, if you are looking for, for riches, he has riches. If you are looking for wisdom, wisdom has riches, wisdom has honor. If you are looking honor, he has them. My fruits is better than gold. Yes, than fine gold. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. I want to thank God that God is so good. 
I pray that God Almighty will deliver us. I am going to stop here. We shall continue. Or you can go and continue the whole subject, the whole top chapter. Read it and finish it by yourself. I want to thank God that God will give you wisdom. That God will give you wisdom. May God fill you with wisdom. May God grant you wisdom. My Father and my God, I pray that God give your people wisdom. Let your wisdom fall upon your people, my God. My Father and my God, people who have been lucky of wisdom, fill them with the wisdom, God. My God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I thank you. Lord, I bless your name. I give you all the glory, my God. My Father, in the name of Jesus, some people who are looking for wisdom, they don't know what to do. My God, provide for them wisdom. Give them wisdom, God, in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray that God Almighty visit your people. Visit them with the new, with the, with the wisdom, God. Fill them with the wisdom, knowledge, God, my Father. In the name of Jesus Christ, my God. I want to thank you, Lord. I want to honor you, my God. I want to give you all the glory. I thank you for the wisdom, God, because wisdom has money. Wisdom is rich. There is riches in wisdom. Therefore, God, my Father, help us. Give us wisdom, how we can do our business, how we can do our work, how we can even take care of our children, how we can take our marriages, how we can take our finances. Give us wisdom, God. I pray that God give your people wisdom, how to take the mothers that is in the, their front, how they are treating others, God, the position you have given them, God. How they will handle God, my Father. Where they are, my God. I pray that give them wisdom. Let wisdom fall upon you in Jesus' name. I pray that God, let it double wisdom fall upon your life in Jesus' name. My God, my Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray that God, my God, look at this person. This person, God, you have called him even into the ministry, but he doesn't know what to do. But you are, are, you are, you are, you are a wisdom we, we pray the blood of Jesus, and I pray that give this person wisdom. The situation you are in, you don't know what to do. You don't know even how to think about it. You, you are confused. I pray that receive wisdom of God to give you a way, to give you a, break, a, a breakthrough. Receive wisdom in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray that God Almighty will provide wisdom. Wisdom will come. You will be a winner. You will get everything you are looking. You will get everything good in the name of Jesus. My God and my Father, I thank you, Lord. I bleed the blood of Jesus over your life, over your family, over your children. Your children need wisdom. Raise your hands and ask God to, to give them wisdom. You need wisdom to take care of the situation you are facing. If you are facing a court case, you need wisdom to help you. If you are facing any situation at the workplace, you need wisdom to help you. Don't sit down to cry and be bitter and, and, and curse yourself. You don't need that. Just to sit down and ask, take, spend a few minutes. Spend a few minutes to ask wisdom to fill you. Say wisdom, here I am. I don't know what to do right now. Come, help me. He said he has everything. You can see the word that is, is saying who he is. He described himself. If you read, you see, in the beginning, before the world was formed, he was there. And he was working with, and she was working with God. So wisdom is, is the wisdom. God was using wisdom, everything he was doing. That's why the enemy is using the queen of the coast, the devil, the woman, Satan, to give people power. Wisdom has everything. If you need the power, he, he, he can give you. He has everything. Wisdom, she has everything according to what he described here in, in the book of, 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 of Proverbs. You ask God to give you wisdom. Wisdom is so powerful that every child of God needs it. If you have wisdom, yes, 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 my sister. So if you need wisdom, there's nothing, good, that, there's nothing difficult that, that can hold wisdom. Because he has the answer. He has, he has everything. So wisdom, you need it. And God will help you. Thank you, Falmat. God bless you so much. 
I will continue from there, from where we have left, and God will continue to bless you. So, I see you. I might come tonight for a few minutes, and uh, tomorrow morning, I'll see if I come 8 o'clock, but mostly I have to come at 4 that or 4 o'clock. So, those days, that, that time I might come in. God bless you so much, and see you in that time. I, I don't know specific time to come in. But God bless you so much. Go to our website. There's new videos of yesterday. All of them, they are there. And also remember to visit our our Facebook page and like like our face, best, uh, Facebook Facebook page. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. God bless you, my friends. Have a wonderful time. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isiki saying bye bye to you. Our website is www.overcomersdheadministries.blogspot.ca All our numbers are underneath the videos. All. You can book Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. You can see our contact. God bless you so much and have a wonderful time. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.